fun Friday. It's it's like my favorite day of the week. Yay! Usually my kids and I, um, we usually watch a movie and eat popcorn on fun Friday. Do you have something fun that you do on Friday? Well today we are going to do something really fun because we have been working on the letter X all week. And what sound does X make? That's right, X, X. And we talked about x-ray fish and we talked about x-rays and we talked about xylophones and even though they don't really sound like the letter x they start with the letter x because sometimes there are some funny weird words right and that's one of them there are some words that end with the letter x like box and box and six they all have the x at the end so today we always do something really fun on Fridays. So let's do our quick review. We are working on the letter X. Let's write it really quickly. I have my star and my moon to help me with my rights and lefts. We are going to make a diagonal line and I call it a slide. So start at the star, slide, go to the moon and slide. And there is our letter X. Hopefully throughout the week, it has gotten easier and easier and easier to make. I know at first it's a little hard, but hopefully it's getting easier. And you can keep practicing and practicing and practicing. My number for the week is 24. So let's make our star and our moon and our star and our moon. We're gonna start out and make our two, which is basically a backward C. We're gonna start at our star and we call it a magic rainbow. There's my magic rainbow and a little road, just like that. Magic rainbow, little road. And then for my four, I start at the star. We go down the ladder, little road. And then I go to my moon and we do a big down the ladder. So down the ladder, little road, and big down the ladder, 24. And we've shown lots of different ways to make the 24. So I'm going to show you one more time. So we have two tens, two tens. Remember, that's these little tiny, little tiny ones, little tiny cubes all glued together. They're all glued together and there's 10 of them. So we go 10, 20. So I got two tens right here. And then I have my four ones. So two tens, four ones makes 24. There we go. So. Our letter of the week is X and our number is 24. Are you guys ready for our fun thing? So one thing my kids and I love doing is treasure hunting. I love treasure hunting. So X always marks the spot, right? So if you can grab a big piece of paper, boop, you can make the letter X because we know how to make the letter X, right? And then you can make a treasure map. So I make, what I usually do is I make lots of little dots. And this is my treasure map. And if you'd like to, you could actually go hide some treasure. And here, here's a tree. And here's my house. And you can actually go make a little treasure map. And then you could hide something for somebody to find. One thing that would be really easy, if you have a sandbox, you can go put an X in the sandbox, hide something underneath it. You could also get a little piece of paper, put X on it, and then on the other side of the little piece of paper, tape a coin. Let's see here. Here's my little scent sign. Whoop. There we go. You could type coin or maybe a dollar. Here's my tape. <laughs> it's kind of messy tape. So on one side it's X, on the other side you could tape like a little coin or maybe a piece of candy or maybe a dollar on the back of a card that has the X on it and then go hide that in the yard and someone can go find it. You could also get like a rock. You could get a rock like this, that's a really heavy rock, and put an X on it, and then tape something cool on the back of it also. So there is some ideas of doing a treasure find, treasure hunt, and finding X marks the spot. Well, I hope you had an awesome week, and hopefully you had an awesome weekend, and I will see you again next week. All right, bye everybody. Mm -hmm.